Hey, this is Ben from Ben's Backwoods. I wanted to uh, talk to you guys real quick about the uh, cotton lamp wick that we sell. Uh, I use it as a snowshoe binding. I want to show you the, uh, the hitch that I use, why I use it, and I'll show you how to tie it. Uh, this is three quarter inch wide cotton lamp wick. Uh, this is about an eight foot section. I sell it in 16 foot sections to give you two eight foot pieces. Uh, most most people are going to be able to get away with tying this hitch with maybe six foot of lamp wick, maybe seven. It depends on what size boots you're using. Uh, and I'll show you why I like this. So this is the hitch I like to use. I first learned about this hitch um, in the Snow Walker's Companion book. Um, what I like about this hitch is I've got a size for my boots. I can leave my mitts on. It's cold out. I step on the snowshoe here, put my toe through the, that loop, swivel it around, twist, and my toe is in the front there and I can I can I can walk like now what I'll do is I'll step on this snowshoe with this one run the boot in there get your toe in there and you're good to go just like that what I like about this uh, if you're in and out of your snowshoes a lot um, this is it's as easy on easy off to get it off twist sideways push forward like this and uh, they pop right off I just kind of step on the shoe to keep it from moving so it, there's in and out just like that um, you just get these things adjusted to fit to fit the whatever footwear you're using. These are my muck boots. Uh, fit this toe area right here, and you get this adjusted to, to fit your heel. And this is a really comfortable binding, really quick and easy. Like I said, in and out just like that. So now I'll show you guys how to tie. Like about this hitch also is um, I've used it with parachute cord uh, quite a bit of times. This makes a quick uh, emergency hitch if you if you were to break a hitch on a snowshoe or something like that. Paracord does a pretty decent job. Um, so here's how we tie it. So I've got my lamp wick here, and what I want to do, and I don't think it matters which way we thread it through, thread one side through here, and the other side over here, and what we're doing is we're creating this toe loop, size that to our footwear, make sure we have about the same amount of lamp wick on each side. Even like that. Okay, that's pretty good. Now what I'll do is I'll wrap this, this loose piece around that toe loop one time. And I'm going to wrap the loose piece around that toe loop on that side one time. And now I should be able to the start of the wrap, but it still gives me the ability to kind of tighten it down and get it, get it kind of snug where I want it. So that's about the size that I want for, the, for these boots. Now I slide my boot out, try to keep uh, the size the same. And what I'll do is give uh, maybe one, two more wraps on this side. Two more wraps on this side. Uh, we'll probably go one more each. And we want to kind of pull it, pull it snug. All right. Yep, that gives us room for another wrap. We just want to get this wrapped up here create this nice toe loop that's about that's pretty dang close to being right right there so what I'll do now is I'll wrap it behind my foot and I tie this is how I do it one overhand knot and I just tie another overhand knot over top of it like I said this is plenty of lamp wick there's probably extra few feet there um, and that's the hitch right there uh, this lamp wick will stretch a little teeny bit and so if it becomes loose on you, what you can do is you can, you can, you have adjustment in here. If this heel strap becomes loose, you can take one more wrap around this way to tighten it up. If you, if you found someone with, with bigger boots that needs to use the same system, you can swing it around this way and loosen it up and give you, give you more room there. So it's, it's quick and easy and uh, it's a really comfortable hitch to use.